All right. <laughs> the voice prompt match game. Enter in. I'm going to enter in some game show music. Uh, Should we? Are we doing the the water thing with it? Oh, yeah. Um, so we're doing spit takes. Water. Next time we'll do drinking game, maybe, but Sunday. <laughs> And I'll right. laugh at ever. Then I won't keep any water in my mouth. <laughs> if you love Kesha as much as I do, or more than I do, so I unironically love Kesha. So let that be known. Do we guess now? Do I guess now? Yeah. Do you want to hear it again? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to I like number one. I can't really see other than like is are they wearing a suit? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> if it's number two, I would just like. Nope, die. you're good there. <laughs> yeah, no, I just, I want it to be number two. I that know. would be extra funny, but. Um, let's see. Number four. Yeah. yeah. Number B. <laughs> number B. Perfect. If you want a provider, I am not him. I am a partner. If you want somebody that's going to pay all your bills, I am absolutely not interested in that. I would like somebody that is as equally invested in every way that I am in whatever it is we end up doing or whatever we end up becoming. So, again, I am a partner. I was joking. <laughs> Oh, uh, is that three? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you better be bringing your own money. That was I, just I, really, it was also just really long. Like, that was a lot. Yeah, like, you don't need to say all of that. May, like, say one thing. Like, just be like, uh, you know, I don't want a gold digger or something. But, you know. Yeah. Honestly, let's just say that that's implied. <laughs> it, I would think it's implied. Or, I don't know. Well, there I are feel, special sites if you're looking for, like, a really rich guy. And you're yeah. like, I'm hot enough to have a rich guy take care of me. There are, like, special sites for that. Yeah. And it's, it's not a really given, a good look saying yeah. right off the bat, like, say, do you want all my money? Go to hell. Like, all right, like, calm down. Okay, like, bro, what did, what job do you have? Like, I might And what makes you, you think? Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> like, what, what if that's the case? Oh, he and he like that. lives with his mom, and you know, I don't know. You, you never. His it's just fragile has no... male ego could not take that. I bet. Yeah, there's Based there's no bar ass. for, um, <laughs> or actually, there's no, uh, we don't know the context of what he means by gold digger in a sense. Like we know, but is, does that mean? You know, we want hundreds of dollars every day, every week. Or are you just saying like split everything? But overall, it's it's negative. It's definitely it's a not negative positive. answer. Yeah. yeah, negative answer. And if it's true, oh, it's true, man. That's what I feel. Okay, but then do it nicer or something. Make it or not the voice prompt. What you could you know? do, actually, even as a voice prompt, is totally flip that and say you're looking for a really strong, independent woman. You're really into that because those are the ones that are going to come with their own finances. Exactly. Point out the good thing instead of like, <laughs> don't ask me for money because I'm not going <laughs> to give it to you. That's a good one. That's really good. Just say I'm looking because then that also builds the um, uh, confidence of the girls who decide to yes. listen to that because for me i'd be like oh i'm independent and i make my own money but yeah. this made me think like ew. okay so he just he he yeah ew he's already complaining prior he's to already anything <laughs> he's already complaining and he doesn't know what my situation is what if i'm a millionaire like right. living life because i had a whatever somebody died like <laughs> <laughs> it's like you never know so somebody dad. <laughs> that's the advice I think we give there is go positive and don't accuse always, every single woman yeah, of right. being poor. Also, just in general, this is a general for written bio spoken. Don't think about all your worst experiences and bring them up. Good call. 
Do you know what I'm talking about? Like, because I've yeah. heard a lot of that feedback, like, well, like every other woman on here yeah. who says, uh, but like, don't, don't start don't do there. That. <laughs> you wonder why you don't, that's a hundred percent why you don't get, if you have some kind of message in your bio that says, I don't want this, I don't want that, you guys yeah. are such, women just do this, but. You better, might as well not even be on Tinder or whatever hinge because go on Grinder then, man. Because <laughs> yeah, because clearly you don't like women. Jeez, not this guy. Just the hypothetical yes ones that we have seen. They're like that. Just don't complain fuck. about oh, remember women. The, they we had that one Asian pen pal one. Like oh, yeah, no Asian. Pen pal. <laughs> <laughs> Flashback. That we um, had to Google because I was like, "What does that mean?" All right. <clears throat> Let us see. So I had lunch with a good friend of mine today and we critiqued each other's hinge profiles and I had a few suggestions for her and she had a lot of suggestions for me. So apparently my profile did not represent me in the way that she saw me. And so I've made some changes to it and um, yeah, I like to be very self-reflective and... I'm always open to criticism. So I don't know the point of that. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Number five. He just, I could hear the voice and see his face. I'm like, that has to be that guy. That's that guy. No. No. Is it number one? Yeah. Okay. It was between the two this of them. This guy. That's who it is. That outfit. That outfit. Though. Is he wearing, is that a full suit? Is that what's happening? Without yeah, the that's a suit. okay, not... I think his eyes are. No, I guess they're open. If I have, if we have to look and guess, maybe you should not put that picture. Zoom in a little, man. Why are yeah. you out so far? <laughs> Did like... someone take that from a helicopter? <laughs> what the? A drone? We do drone photography. Yeah. Thanks for All putting right. up your drone photo. All right, I know for sure which ones go which. So. Um, I'm not going to do the water because I get, as soon as it starts getting warm, <laughs> I swallow it. I don't have it. <laughs> oh, that's what um, she said. Ah, <laughs> damn it. All right. Weirdest gift I have given or received. Oh, yeah. Then I can do commentary. Okay. Weirdest gift I have ever given or received. Okay. Probably when I woke up one morning and found gumbo. <laughs> on my porch. I just thought that pause was funny. Of gumbo. On, on my porch. My porch. <laughs> really oh uh, stretching to get one of them uh, voice prompts in. There. Is that two? No. Nope. God, I want everyone to be two. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be so satisfied. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> That one's five, right? Nope. Really? See, six is honestly really hard for me to even. Is he doing this? Is he doing a like a the? It would be like my what? Yeah, yeah. He was. He's hard to make out what his vibe was from. Yeah, from that for sure. He's he, like an introverted metalhead. Yeah. <laughs> so wait, somebody gave him gumbo. That's an awesome gift, bro. Right. Like someone made right. you something. That's not weird. Okay, get ready for this. Weed ain't no drug. It is just a plant. I have done the research, all right? It just grows. That's all I do. And if you just so happen as to set it on fire, <laughs> there are some effects. You know what the effects are? Hungry, happy, slippy. That's it. I don't know what anyone else is talking about. So, yeah, that's legitimately my best... Uh, celebrity impersonation voice. Pleasure to meet you. My name is Rob. That's number two. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That was so much better than I could have been asked for. <laughs> I was okay. like, that has to be that guy. Yeah. Scraggly beard, no hair on his head, colored oh. glasses. Weed ain't no drug. It is just a plant. I have done the research, all right? It just grows. That's all I do. And if you just so happen as to set it on fire, there are some effects. You know what the effects are? Hungry, happy, slippy. That's it. 
I don't know what anyone else is talking about. Um, so, yeah, that's legitimately my best uh, celebrity impersonation voice. Pleasure to meet you. My name is Rob. <laughs> do you know, bonus question, do you know who that was? No. I know. I see some of y'all. <laughs> Look, I understand. If you ain't smoking weed because you got a good job, then by all means, make your paper, boo-boo. But if you ain't got no job and you're not smoking weed, I don't know what the f*** you are doing with your life. I really don't. I really don't. Don't give me that about it's a drug. It ain't no motherfucking drug. I done done the research. It's just a plant. It just grow like that. And if you should happen to set it on fire, <laughs> there are some effects. But that's not the same as drugs. Drugs, you got to do shit to it chemically. You got to add baking soda, water, stir it up. I don't know the recipe. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's some shit you got to do to it. Well, why the fuck is it legal? I don't know. Aspirin is perfectly legal. But if you take 13 of them motherfuckers, it'll be your last headache. <laughs> Long as you've been living, you ain't never heard of a motherfucker overdose on marijuana. You might have thought that was dead. He ain't dead. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna wake up in 30 minutes, hungry enough to eat up everything in your house. That's the side effect. Hungry, happy, sleepy. That's it. <laughs> well, That's I, I will like. say this much. Um, I didn't think of Cat Williams because he sounded so like he had a southern accent. Yeah, let's do it. Weed ain't no drug. It is just a plant. I have done the research. Wait, all right? about <laughs> it just grows. That's all I do. And if you just so happen as to set it on fire, there are some effects. You know what the effects are? Hungry, happy, slippy. That's it. I don't know what anyone else is talking about. So, yeah, that's legitimately my best uh, celebrity impersonation voice. Pleasure to meet you. My name is Rob. Hello, Rob. Okay, so, but on, in all honesty, this makes me think he's cool. Yeah, no, I mean, he has, he's funny. Yeah, he's funny. He picked he, a funny um, thing to. And that's no, n never what I have guessed. And he has a nice voice, regular voice. <laughs> Luckily. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, yeah, correct. So worth it. That was so satisfying. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I was like, oh, his like, voice so high. Oh. He made his voice so high pitched. I was like, what? <laughs> okay. And so obviously. Can't wait to see what this is. The special talent of mine is blowing bubbles with my tongue and actually tying the cherry stem with my tongue also. Are we in fucking high school? What? <laughs> is he talking hmm. about gleeking? What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, that's not a talent, bro. What? A special talent of mine is blowing bubbles with my tongue and actually tying a cherry stem with my tongue also. Yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry. Blowing bubbles with his tongue. Does that mean spit bubbles? Spit bubbles, yes. That's a, gross. That's a what spit bubble. That's what toddlers do. Mm-hmm. Where they go. That's what I'm saying. It's not a talent. That's like if I was like, my special talent is picking my boogers out of my nose and eating them. That's Basically. not a talent. That's just a weird, gross thing you do. Ugh. I bow bubbles with, you know, he would be well off, but way better off not having one of these. <laughs> like the boys. <laughs> Some this people just like, skip it if, if yeah. you can't say something semi-normal. Yeah. Then it's okay. Like, don't push yourself for something like this if you like are excited to do it and and showcase your personality i think it's great that you do these if you're reaching like i don't if you're want reaching to do for it, the answer yeah if you're like i don't have a talent what could i say is my talent skip that one don't do yeah. it yeah because you should be like in something real weird like blowing bubbles with my tongue with my mouth spit that's literally what what five-year-olds do and it drives me nuts when they do it too because it's so gross <laughs> i'm like you're gonna get your f it's gonna pop and all the germs are gonna, you're gonna go, go all over <laughs> yeah and then so. like ch and chasing it with their tongue maybe he needed to make it a video so i can see what he's talking about show i know me. right show me what you mean by that sir 
Let me see. You want to blow a spit bubble at me? Is that what you're saying? And I'm going to be like, you're so talented. 